Hey everybody, I'm Tim Turk and welcome back to HockeySkillsTraining.com. Thanks for being a subscriber and signing up. In this video, we're going to talk about getting a pass from the goalie. In some certain situations that we get into, we have nowhere to shoot. There's no target to get at to hit the mesh with the puck. So we're going to use the goalie to get the puck to come back. We call this pad passes. In certain situations, the goalies will go down and if the puck is going wide but it's close to the post, they'll still try to make the save. And we're hoping that it hits their pad and comes out, causing a rebound for us to take advantage of. Uh, one of our teammates are gonna be in front of the net. So this is what it looks like, the pad pass off the goalie from an angle. Yeah, very good. Two more. Nice save. Okay, in this situation, you can see the goalie is in his reverse vertical horizontal position. The idea is to find a spot where it goes off the pads and in. Yeah, that's it, very good. Nice, very nice. Pad passes are successful if you hit the pads and shooting the puck low a lot of times. Players, they want to shoot high, want to try and find those open areas, but you have a better, higher chance of getting a rebound off the goalie than off the glass. You can see here the key word is sacrifice. Your teammates to get those passes have to go to the net. And in future videos, we're gonna talk about driving the net and where your stick should be and how your body should be positioned so you're ready for what comes next at all times. Pad passes can cause second chance opportunities, create more offense for your team, but you have to get to the net, get the puck to the net to allow that to happen.